Hey guys, and welcome back to Haunting Grounds. I always go to Haunting Grounds. It's Haunting Ground. When we last left off, we managed to find the map. Ooh. Something's happening. God. <laughs> uh, oh, I can only imagine what his breath smells like. Oh, where are we going? Uh, Oh, that's bad. That's really bad. <laughs> Ooh, who's that? I am Ricardo, keeper of the castle. So sorry to hear about your accident. Your parents. As Master Ugo and Mistress Ayla are both deceased, you, Miss Fiona, are the sole surviving heir of Belly Castle. Are you in pain, miss? Will you be all right? You've had a long day. Please, rest upstairs. Your bed has been prepared. Wait. What? So it's our castle? Let's think about this. Uh, Mummy and Daddy are dead. And we now have a cool castle. We just have to teach the uh, inhabitants who's in charge around here.
Hey. Oof. Oh, Higgy. Not on my watch. Let's go get our pupper back. Oh, actually, I suppose we should probably put down a proper save as well. So, we're actually the heir to the castle. So, okay, I mean, that means we need to start telling these motherfuckers what time it is around here instead of being chased around and stuff. But mum and dad are dead. That's fine. We don't remember them, so it doesn't matter. And this is quite a badass castle. Now, maybe we should go meet the rest of the people. Ah, where's up? Oh, the papa is by the big tree. Ah, papa! No! Poor little papa. Unforgivable! A wire is bound to the poor animal. It's digging deep, what? Deeply into the dog's neck. Oh, no way, we're not having that. There's one cool papa. Go. I can't believe there are people out there that would do this to poor helpless animals. And that man, so big and freaky. I just want to get out of this nightmare as soon as I can. Yeah, well... The wire looks like it got snagged on something. So many wounds, so much blood. You poor thing. With all these wounds, there's no wonder you are howling in pain. Yeah. Poor dog. Well, we've saved our pooch friend. Ah, uh, yes, that big man. Well, I mean, apparently he's our employee now, I guess. Which means we can unemploy him if you catch my drift. Ooh. Yeah, animal cruelty, man, it's really fucked up. I mean, do what you want to another person. I mean, I, whatever. People are just horrific to each other. Um, it's really sad, but to do something to an animal, man, that's pretty fucked up. Ooh. Oh, dear. What is this? I mean, you shouldn't really, you know, hurt anything, really. But... Looks like there's something up there. Okay, what could possibly go wrong here? Oof. Um, can we try that again? It's going to be too hard for me to get up there. Right, specifically for me. So I'm guessing we need to get somebody else to go up there. Medallion. So we've got another one of these medallions. There seems to be a few of those around. Alright, well, there's a door there. And I'm guessing we can't go through this door. Nope. So close and yet so far. Alright, well, we can't worry about that yet. Um, now. Early castle front. So, um, uh, are these... So whatever's in red, is that where we're supposed to go to? Is that our next objective? The door is locked from the other side. Okay, that's fine. Oh, right. We were collecting the plate thing, weren't we? Because we got one half of it. 
I'm guessing we need the other part of the plate. So, let's go back inside. Oh. Can we do anything? Now we've unleashed the dog. Yugi. Or Huey. Can we do anything with this? Because I'm guessing we need to get the dog to go through there. Yeah, too small for me. However, notice how me isn't highlighted. The door is blocked by that wooden box. Yeah, so I guess we can't do anything with it still. Alright. <sighs> is she getting... Oh, she's getting tired. So you can't just indefinitely sprint. I mean, that makes sense. It could be worse. She's got a decent amount of stamina, but then, you know, she looks like a healthy woman, so she should be able to, you know, run for a, f a somewhat decent amount of time. Evil within, anybody? Oh no. <laughs> Chill out. I'm guessing he's the one push up on the right analog stick to command the dog to attack. Okay. Oh, nice! What the fuck? Dude, again! Oh, hell yeah! That was sick! Right, we need to keep this dog around. Need to feed him some jerky or something. Was the game always this blurry? Uh, uh, thank you. You saved me. Hey, pupper. Come here. Come on, boy. The frickin' PS2 game, man. What's your name? <laughs> you know what his name is. Huey? Huey. So you're Huey. Well, hi, Huey. What's our name? Right, additional dog commands. Huey has befriended you. Give him various commands via the right analog stick. Up commands. Normal mode. Search the surrounding area. Battle mode. Attack. Whilst biting the enemy, push up to urge Huey on, increasing the amount of time he bites an enemy. Down commands. Normal mode. Call Huey to your side. Whilst biting uh, enemy, press down to stop Huey from biting enemy. Okay. Scold to... Oh, right. If Huey begins to act disobediently, scold him for his actions. This will have an effect on how Huey responds to you. Right commands. Praise. If Huey is especially respondent to a command or does something that is praiseworthy, then praise his actions. This will have an effect on how Huey responds to you. Also, praise Huey while nearby and he will slightly regain some stamina. Push R3. Normal mode. Command Huey to sit in that location. Battle mode. Order Huey to wait. This increases Huey's attack power temporarily. Ah, 
Okay, sometimes, depending on circumstances, Huey may ignore some commands. In those circumstances, try approaching Huey and reissuing a command whilst you're standing next to him. If timed right, the scold command can also be effective in these situations. Dog. Huey! Good boy. Who's a good boy? Oh, let's give Huey some loving. Oh, yes. Good boy. Good boy. There we go. Good doggo. Who's best doggo? Good boy. Yeah, who's the bestest boy? Right. Sit. We can tell him to sit. Come on. Sit. Okay. Come on. So we don't really want to scold him. Huey. So I know there's like a friendship kind of thing in this game. Go, Huey. Have a look. See if you can find any goodies. Is there anything around, boy? Huh? Yeah? Ooh. Whoa, no way. Medallion. Go, Huey. Anything else around here, boy? <laughs> oh, no way. Oh, come on. This is fucking cool, man. This is so cool. Oh, it's okay, boy. At least you tried. Good boy. Good doggo. Right, now we've got the pooch. Let's save the game. Oh, I, I don't know, man. I, I think I'm going to like this little doggo mechanic we've got here. I mean, I, I'm not a huge dog person. I like dogs. I like all animals. Uh, more of a cat person, but... This is fucking cool, man. This is cool. I like. Oh, I bet there's loads of shit outside we can find, isn't there? Oh, hang on. We can go outside and... There was that... Come on, boy. There was that, um... Little area outside, wasn't there? Go, Huey. Go. Go find me some stuff, Huey. Go on, boy. Come on. Go, Huey. Find me things. Find. This is a freaking PS2 game, man. Look at the like detail and the animation and stuff. Like on everything. It really is top tier. Oh, Huey, dude. That's cool, man. You did your best. It's not your fault there's nothing here. Right, let's go. Now, see if there's anything out here. Oh, this is going to be way too much fun. Look at the way he's walking around, having a sniff snort everywhere. Oh, Huey. <laughs> Good boy. Bestest boy. Right, let's go. Now, uh, over here, boy. Come on. Come here, boy. Right. Can you go under here? Huey. You can. Hey. Right. Now, can you? Go, Huey. Can you shift this box? Oh, who's a clever boy? Oh, that's a good boy. Huey. Huey's best boy. Right, come here. Have some loving and some cuddles. Good boy. Good dog. If I had loads of like treats, so I'd give them to you. But I'm assuming treats are your help for your health bar. Uh oh. Okay. A ball. It looks like some kind of doggo. Oh, this is like a tutorial area, isn't it? Blatantly. Come on. Blatantly a little training area. Good boy. Okay. So. Go, Huey. Go, Huey. Can we like attack these things? Yeah, we can. Go, Huey. Good boy. Yeah, so I know there's some kind of like invisible friendship meter that the game calculates behind the scenes. And by building up your friendship with the dog, uh, he becomes more powerful and Ah. That's interesting. So if I push down on the analog stick, that's the same as... Alright, I don't know what happened there. Yeah, um... Friendship with the dog, uh... 
makes him better, more powerful, but also you can upset him and neglect him and make him feel not wanted and stuff, apparently. And if you do that, then he gets upset. Beef jerky. Alright. What's this? Like some kind of altar. Well, that's another area outside here exploring. Anyway. So, let's have a look at the ball. Cracked plate. Medallion. Lavender. Oh, there's the ball. This handy ball can be used for playing simple games with canine companions. No way. Alright, let's give that a go. And so that we can actually learn how to use the... Oh, look at he's waving his tail. Oh, come on, boy. Good boy. Good boy. Oi, 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 oi. Over here. Go get him, boy. Uh, that was not the best throw in the world. Go, Huey. Go get it. You know, on the ball. Never known a... Do oh. Right. Can we not... Can we not pick it up? Go, Huey. What if we come say on. come here? Can we really not pick the ball up? Come on. I guess Huey. once you throw the ball, you can't get it back. That's kind of lame. Go, Huey. Right. Go see if you can find anything around here, dude. Go on, see what you can find. There's got to be something around here. That's it. Get the sniff snooter out. Good boy. Good boy. Oh man, I want a dog. Oh, that's all right, buoy. You can't help it. Good boy. Good doggo. Right, yeah, because Fable tried to make you attached to the dog. Uh, Fable 2 and 3. Trouble with Fable 2 and 3 is they were, um, you know, dog shit. You had Fable 1 that really showed some awesome promise. Um, come on, boy. And then, ooh, can we get him to chase the rabbits or something? And then you had Fable 2 and 3, which just literally were fucking rubbish. Go get the rabbit. Go get the rabbit. Go get the rabbit. Go on. Go, Huey. Go get the rabbit. Can you get the rabbit? Go, Huey. No, no, no. Don't be like that, boy. Go get the rabbit. Go, Huey. Go get him. Go get him. Go on. Is that rabbit hiding anything? Ah, oh, all right then. All right, all right. That's enough. Arson around with uh, Huey. Good boy. Let's go. Well, thanks, Leon, for um, lending us Huey. Come on. Oh boy. Let's go. There we go. Happy Papa. Right. So now. I guess we're going to go back upstairs. At least we can defend ourselves against that, like, fucking weird pervert monstrosity called Diabetes or whatever he was called. Alright. Yeah, I don't want to get attacked by diabetes. So, we still are looking for more items. Uh, we can go down, yeah, well, right, so, down here, funny enough, was the door that we opened earlier, and that just leads to the dining room, which is fine, ooh, oh, the maid, What's cooking? Hello, can we speak to her? She looks busy preparing dinner. 
Perhaps this isn't the best time to strike up a conversation. Ooh. Hughie's not happy. Can we? Right, kick her. No. Right, so life is uh, actually going on in the castle. Come on. <laughs> I like the way Hughie, like literally, um, or Huey, I should say, just fucks off and runs off places. Now, let's get him down here and see if we can find anything in the cellar. Cowboy. Come on. Wow, he's uh He's not the fastest boy, is he? Good boy. Good boy. Right, have a oh. little look round here, boy. See what you can find. Looks like there's a yep, there is a giant rat hanging right above our head. Cool. Come on. Okay, so sometimes you have to shout at him twice, but that's fine. Oh, what you found, boy? Had to be something down here. Lavender. All right. Well, you know. Go. We'll have it. Go. What have you got, boy? What have you got? What have you got? <laughs> Love the way he just scampers around. <laughs> This is fucking brilliant. This is fucking great. Oh, that's all right, boy. Good that's boy. all right. You good boy. Right, let's get out of here. So, uh, still got to find this plate, which is somewhere. Uh, so, things are happening in the castle. Like, you get the feeling that, you know, there is a, a passage of time going on. Um, so, there is a clock back here. Now, I wonder... Maybe there's no knob on the door. There's a hook. Can we use the cracked plate? No. So we do need to find the rest of it. Although, can we get Huey to stand on this? Come on. Huey. Come here, boy. We can. Right, so Huey can stand on the pressure plate, which is okay, but what does that do exactly? Oh. Have we been down here before? Oh, crack plate. Uh, there's a crack key. What could this be used for? There appears to be a slot for s of sorts. Could this be some kind of lock? Definitely. So we need... How am I going to get this open? So I guess we need to use the plate. Yeah. Alright, well... Looks like this isn't enough. I will need to reforge this plate key to be able to use it. Uh, right, so what does it say then? ST. And, oh, rest. Okay. I wonder. Um, could we actually have forged that plate key before? That's quite interesting. Uh, when I play this again, I might try and do that, you know? I'll come prepared. Come on, Hugi. Why do I keep saying Hugi? What's ah? Hugi's from the boys. Yes, that's why it's in my brain. Ah, uh, so let's go. Huey. Come on, Huey. Come on. Come on. Come on. Right. Don't like the way he keeps falling behind us. I can see that getting annoying. But it's not the end. Oh. Something's creaking away. Oh, it's the chandeliers. That's fine. Huey. Come on, boy. Come on. Come on. 
What's up, boy? What's up? Sit. Sit. Shake. Wait, what? Shake. <laughs> so if you tell him to sit, shake. You can shake his paw. Oh my god, that's so fucking cool. Alright, cool. Alright, go, boy. Good boy. You. Go, Huey. Let's go, buddy. Let's go see what we can see. Now, is there anything in this room? Go, Huey. Have a little sniff around. That's it. What can you find? What can you find? Oh, he's, he's got something. He's... Got something. Ah, oh, that's all right, boy. You can't find everything. Don't you worry about a thing. Right, so we need to... Oh! Okay. Shit. How do we go back? Oh, there we go. So, the door slammed behind us, apparently. Why did the door slam behind us? What was that about? Anything in here, Huey? Go, Huey. Huey! God damn it, that's never going to go in my brain, is it? That's never going to go in my brain. <laughs> oh, that's all right, boy. That's all right, boy. Don't you worry about a thing. Right, come on, boy. Ooh. Huey. Now, how does Huey get down the... S Ooh. Go, Huey. Can he... No fucking way. Oh, that was cool. That was really cool. Ah, oh, Huey. That was so cool. What did we get from that? Album medallion. High quality alchemic component. Yeah, we still don't know what this whole um, alchemy process, refining process actually is, but you know. I'm sure at one point all will be revealed. Come on, Hugh. Ah, there's got to be something outside, surely. There's got to be something in here, isn't there, boy? Come on, boy. What can you find? Huh? There's a beef jerky in it for you. Ah, oh, well. Dogs that don't find anything don't get beef jerkies, I'm afraid. But you do get some loves. Good boy. Plenty of scritches. Come on, boy. Right, okay. So, we still need a hook. Alright, I actually thought... Is that for, like, golem door? There's a hook. Right, I actually thought... Um... Funny enough... That we were going to have to use the broken plate on that to open that. I never thought there was going to be anything here. So, let's uh, put the plate in this door. But, that is going to have to be for next time. Because we're out of time here, guys. Um, this, is <laughs> this is cool, man. This is so different from anything else I've played. And it isn't the traditional bullshit that I hate with a pursuer enemy that you can't do anything with. You know, like amnesia, for instance. I don't get amnesia. Ha ha, I realise what I just said there. Uh, I don't get the hype around the amnesia games. I thought they were f shit. Uh, I mean, the story was okay, I guess. Um, but the gameplay was just so dull. And... Uh, as well as Outlast. 
and Outlast 2, the whole hide and seek gameplay, because I don't get scared by these games, I wish I did because that would add a nice little extra dynamic to the game, but because I don't have that dimension of getting freaked out and scared, I'm left with just being bored and, oh no, a monster, let's go run and hide and wait for the invisible countdown for the monster to disappear. I mean, Amnesia was terrible for it. There was, oh, the monsters were so bad in that game. Like, they were so easy to manipulate and just make them disappear. And from what I can remember from the original Amnesia, you couldn't die, could you, if I remember correctly? You just kind of got reset to a save point. But if you got reset to the point after getting caught, the monster that was chasing you had then despawned. Oh, I, yeah, awful stuff. Um, I think Soma, or Soma, however you want to say it, that was different. That was a nice little one-shot playthrough because it had such a gripping and interesting story. Now, on the surface, this is a very hide-and-seek style of game. But <laughs> once you start playing it, there's so much more to it than that. This is a really interesting story, especially at a very interesting atmosphere. This whole idea that you're running around this castle uh, as this young, you know, pretty weak girl being chased by some pretty strange creatures. And the worst thing about it is they don't just seem to want to kill you. There is... There's stuff that's a little bit more devious going on, but the the exploration of the castle so far is really fun, um, especially with some of the mechanics you do have, like the ability to run and a, a kick and push and knock things over. And then you throw the dog dynamic into it, and the gameplay loop just gets a little bit deeper again. Um, yeah, needless to say, I've been surprised by this game so far i'm very impressed anyway i'm gonna leave it there thank you very much for watching guys and as always till next time